Hello everyone, this is from Milwaukee to Nashville. I'm Danny Goodwill, and over there is John Lewandowski, and we are from Milwaukee to Nashville. We cover everything Admirals and Predators related. Today we have the Milwaukee Admirals versus the Grand Rapids Griffins. Before we get into that, our show is brought to you by the number one folks in hockey in Milwaukee, Hockey Locker, 2002 West Hart Avenue, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. You can call them at 414 eight zero zero seven five eight five or visit their website at hockeylockermilwaukee.com. All right. So the Admirals took on the Grand Rapids Griffins today. Shots on goal in the first period, Grand Rapids outshoots Milwaukee twelve to five. In the second, Milwaukee outshoots Grand Rapids twelve to seven. In the third, Milwaukee outshoots Grand Rapids 13 to 7. And in total, Milwaukee outshoots Grand Rapids 30 to 26. Now on the power play, Milwaukee goes one for two with eight minutes, four infractions, while Grand Rapids goes one for three with six minutes, three infractions. So we got to play goal, so that's a good thing. Yeah. Scoring in the first period for Grand Rapids was Emil Vero. Scoring his first of the year, assisted by Simon Edvinson, his 14th, and Zach Austin Reese, his 7th. And at the 1452 mark, Grand Rapids scores again with a goal from Carter Mazur, his 10th, assisted by Austin Zarnick, his 9th, and Jonathan Berggren, his 16th. That was on the power play. In the second, Jokub Kebel gets them on the the Admirals on the board with a power play goal with an assist from Jordan Gross, his ninth, and Igor Akhmanasi of his tenth. Um, uh, secretively this year, the playmaker Igor Akhmanasi. <laughs> mm-hmm. Um, then at the third at the eight eight fifty nine mark. Fedor Shvechkov gets his 31st point of the year. That was his 31st. Oh, wow. Um, with, his, with his 11th goal of the season with an assist from Joachim Kebel, his te- uh, 13th, and Jordan Gross, his 10th. So Gross is into double digits now. And assists. Um, and then at the... 18-14 mark, Igor Afanasyev scores his 15th, uh, I believe that to be team-leading 15th goal, with an assist from the team leader in points currently, Mark Jankowski, with his 23rd assist, and the all-star from Mequon, Spencer Stassi, with his ninth. <coughs> in that for the uh, Grand Rapids Griffins was Michael Hutchinson. Hutchinson's bounced around the league a while, including playing quite a few years with the um, Minnesota, uh, Manitoba Moose organization there with Winnipeg. I believe he was the backup for uh, um, them for a while, was Hutchinson. Um, their backup is Sebastian Kosa who is a young, budding uh, prospect. Lots of good young goalies in the league. Uh, Kosa, they're taking their time with him. Uh, unlike uh, the uh, opposition, where Yaroslav Askarov, straight to the fire. <laughs> mm-hmm. That's But that's the way he likes it, too. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, he stopped 24 of 26. So, Hutchinson stopped 27 of 30, and Igor stopped 24 of 26. Your reigning Player of the Week, uh, Yaroslav Askarov. Askarov um, now has won three straight. Um, Your three stars of the game were Emil Vero uh, for Grand Rapids with a goal. Uh, Second star was uh, Joachim Kebel with a goal and an assist. And Igor Afanasyev with a goal and an assist, including the game-winning goal. The Admirals, with this win and Manitoba losing, which they did lose to Bellevue four to nothing. Um, this puts the Admirals in a standing spot of forty-one points. 
tied with Texas for the lead in the division. Um, the Admirals have are, have a goal differential of 103, 4 of 83, which is the lowest in the division. Uh, goals against. The Admirals have 83 goals against. That is the lowest in the division. And minus Coachella and Bakersfield. But Bakersfield's only played 26 games. Where we've played 31. All right. Out of teams who have played 31 or more, the Admirals are second in that statistic. Actually, they are third in that statistic. Hershey's number one at 76 goals. So statistically saying the Admirals are third in the league in goals given up, which is a really good statistic to have. Yeah. Uh, I, I and first in or second best in your division by ten. Now, as I said that we have a couple all-stars, yes, Yaroslav Askarov and Spencer Stetsny are going to the to say you got to go to San Jose, where they do not have professional hockey. I sorry. Did you not get joke? You did not watch beginning of season. They where they did not win. All righty. So with that being said, um, we will be back at some point this weekend with a the weekend coverage. But I have a lot going on. John has a lot going on. So where we find time, we will never know. <laughs> um, but with them playing on the West Coast, it makes it a little harder. Yeah. Uh, the Admirals travel to Henderson. Good luck to all the season ticket holders who are going. I know there's a group of them. See you then. Thank you all for watching, and we will, like I said, be back this weekend. Um, next weekend, we will be doing In the System again. Hopefully, I will be fully healed. Um, I've been going through another bout, bout with RSV, and I think I kicked it, but I'm not 100% sure yet. I'll see what the next couple days go, but the last couple days, I've been okay, so... Um, I will see you all then.